Today is September the 14th, 2011. It's been about three hours since I've had the radio pharmaceutical for a uh, nuclear stress test. I did a video just a little while ago on it. But uh, since uh, I rarely ever have this done, hopefully not even again, I'm going to document it in a second way that you might find interesting. Because I don't get the opportunity to do this often. Hope, like I say, never do it again. But anyway, I'm at a distance from the uh, Geiger counter. And I'm in a basement. You can probably hear it popping a little bit over there. That's pretty normal background radiation. I'm going to walk up to it now. And I've got it. Uh, and that's me setting it off. This is a uh, program you can get off the internet that you can plug the output of your Geiger counter into. And it'll record the pulses. Um, I used this with my grandson. and his sister not too long ago for a uh, science project at Trinity site. And now I'm going to use it here. You can see the numbers up here. This is 486, 540, and you see the number of pulses. So this was background right here. I'm here at 54 counts per minute every so often and then it started rising as I walked up and now I'm sitting in front of it right here. Now I'm going to do what I did on the first video. I'm going to pick this thing up and I'm going to put it under my heart. Okay, now watch, watch the scale change up here. Let's see what it is now. Watch when I stick this thing under my heart. Watch the scale change. So I'm, my hand is not terribly radioactive. Put it to my foot. There's my left foot. Right here, if you can see it. So all parts of me are uh, really going to town here. And for last but not least, I'm going to go stick between my legs. That's pretty scary. That's even more than my heart. thing to do before uh, to show your girlfriend before going on a blind date <laughs> but uh, it's something fun to play with and I, I just can't help but document this I love to document things for just what they are I'm not trying to make a, a call I'm not trying to scare anybody I assume that this is a perfectly safe procedure um, but there it is for what it's worth and uh, no all of my stuff is not calibrated uh, according to the medical industry it's just I'm an amateur and this is what I get and what I get is what you see. So I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> 